Is it time to buy or sell PayPal stock? In this video, we are delving into PayPal. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, the 25th of September, 2024, and we are here to provide you with an even more comprehensive analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay informed about our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any critical updates that could influence your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Harness the power of AI and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any one among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be taken as financial advice. Since the 13th of August, 2024, our system has designated PayPal as a buy candidate, awarding it a score of 3.08. Now let's examine the stock's performance during this time frame. Those who adhered to our analysis would have experienced an impressive gain of 18.81% since we initially identified PayPal as a buy candidate 31 days ago. This corresponds to an average return of 0.61% per day since it was recognized as a buy candidate. The stock is positioned in the upper segment of a broad and robust rising trend in the short term. This scenario typically presents an excellent selling opportunity for short-term traders as a reaction back towards the lower segment of the trend is anticipated. A breakout above the upper trend line at $78.65 will initially signal a stronger upward momentum. The current three-month trend indicates a potential change of 33.09% over the next three months, with a possible return ranging from 21.41% to 35.31%. In terms of the 12-month trend, it suggests an expected change of 18.75% over the next year with a potential return between negative 8.91% and 20.33%. This translates to a price range of $70.47 to $93.09 .09 after one year. Our latest daily update for PayPal includes the headline, Red Day on Wednesday for PayPal. The PayPal stock price decreased by 1.25% on the last day, which was Wednesday, the 25th of September, 2024. It fell from $78.34 to $77.36. During the last trading day, the stock fluctuated by 2.48%, with a low of $77.34 and a high of $79.26. The price has increased in seven of the last 10 days and is up by 11.55%, over the past two weeks. Volume saw an increase on the last day by 2 million shares, although this occurred alongside falling prices. This may indicate an early warning, suggesting a slight increase in risk over the coming days. In total, 14 million shares were traded, amounting to approximately $1 billion, $50 million. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest stock price was $79.26 while the lowest was $50.25. Currently, the price is 2.40% or $1.90 below the 52-week high and 75.06% or $232.80 below the all-time high reached on July 26, 2021, when the price peaked at $310.16. PayPal Holdings has made a significant move by allowing U.S. merchants to buy, hold, and sell cryptocurrency directly from their business accounts. This enhancement not only provides businesses with greater flexibility in managing digital currencies, but also positions PayPal to capitalize on the growing demand for crypto solutions among merchants. Such development could potentially lead to increased transaction volumes and customer engagement which may drive revenues higher in the short term. Furthermore, analysts are optimistic about PayPal's continued growth, with recent trading showing the stock reaching heights not seen since early 2023, reflecting a roughly 55% increase
from its 2023 lows. This momentum suggests positive market sentiment and renewed investor confidence. As the holiday season approaches, forecasts indicate robust consumer spending amid a favorable economic environment, bolstered by anticipated interest rate cuts. These factors combined could further fuel PayPal's stock performance, especially as e-commerce continues its upward trend. In the long term, PayPal's strategic new partnerships and its overall pivot towards enhancing its crypto offerings could fortify its market position, likely leading to sustainable growth and value creation for shareholders. These developments make PayPal a stock worth watching closely in the evolving financial technology landscape. Analyst Ratings On Monday, September 23, 2024, it was reported that Deutsche Bank assigned PYP a buy grade along with a hold action. On Wednesday, September 18, 2024, Goldman Sachs also gave PYP a buy grade with a hold action. On the same day, UBS rated PYP as underperform with a hold action. Additionally, on Wednesday, September 18, 2024, Wells Fargo rated PYP with a market perform grade and a hold action. Earlier on Wednesday, August 28, 2024, Bank of America Securities provided PYPL with a neutral grade alongside a hold action. Analysts have assigned a general neutral rating to PayPal stock. The price-to-earnings ratio is rated as strong sell, and the price-to-book ratio is also rated as strong sell. However, for return on investment, the analysts have given the stock a buy rating. The following signals have been identified for PayPal. The PayPal stock displays buy signals from both short-term and long-term moving averages, suggesting a positive outlook for the stock. Additionally, there is a general buy signal indicated by the relationship between these averages, where the short-term average is positioned above the long-term average. In the event of a downward correction, Support is expected near the levels of $76.08 and $70.72. A decline below either of these levels would trigger sell signals. Moreover, there is a buy signal generated from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, or MACD. However, some negative signals have also emerged which may impact the stock's near-term performance. A sell signal was triggered from a pivot top point on Tuesday, the 10th of September, 2024, and thus far, the stock has increased by 12.36%. Further decline is anticipated until a new bottom pivot is established. Notably, volume increased as prices fell yesterday, serving as an early warning, indicating that the stock should be monitored closely. Here are some additional signals that may interest you. Moving average convergence divergence indicates a buy signal. Pivots generated a sell signal 12 days ago. Bollinger Bands signaled a buy two days ago. Short-term moving average issued a buy signal 11 days ago. Long-term moving average provided a buy signal 42 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages gave a buy signal 41 days ago. When examining the 12-month chart, we observe short moving average signaled a buy nine days ago. Long-term moving average indicated a buy signal 35 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages generated a buy signal 28 days ago. For more signals, be sure to visit our page at stockinvest.us. Support, risk, and stop loss for PayPal. PayPal finds support from accumulated volume at $76.76. .76. This level may present a buying opportunity as an upward reaction can be anticipated when this support is tested. The stock exhibits average daily movements and with healthy trading volume, the risk level is considered medium. Over the past day, the stock fluctuated by $1.92, which is 2.48%. In the last week, the stock experienced a daily average volatility of 2.65%. Before we dive into the potential trading levels for PayPal, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, let's discuss the price to earnings ratio, commonly referred to as the PE ratio. This important ratio assesses a company's current share price in relation to its earnings per share. 
A relatively low P.E. ratio might indicate a low expectation for the company's future performance or suggest that the stock is undervalued, signaling a potential buying opportunity. In other news, the next earnings report for the third quarter of 2024 is anticipated on the 6th of November, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates stand at $1.06. It is important to monitor these figures as they can significantly influence stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for PayPal. In the event of an upward trend, the first resistance level for PayPal is at $77.57. If you do not own any shares, it may be wise to wait for this level to be surpassed before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could serve as a consideration for swing trading. On the downside, PayPal faces its first support level at $76.76. .76. If this support level holds, it may provide a favorable entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for PayPal from various analyst sources is neutral. Now let's examine some recent insider trades. The five most recent insider trades were conducted by Keller Frank, who bought and sold 4,932 shares or options in the company. Analyzing the 100 most recent insider trades, we find that the insider power is positive with a ratio of approximately 67.367. In total, insiders acquired 1,075,999 shares and disposed of 202,395 shares during the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $74.90, reflecting a decline of 3.17%. This stock experiences medium daily fluctuations, indicating a medium level of risk. Additionally, there is a sell signal stemming from a pivot top identified 18 days ago. Is PayPal stock a good buy? Several short-term indicators, combined with an overall positive trend, suggests that the current level presents a potential buying opportunity. There is a reasonable expectation for PayPal stock to perform well in the near future. Upon analyzing the volatility and movements from the last trading day, our systems indicate that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Thursday, the 26th of September, we anticipate PayPal to open at approximately 626 ten thousandths of a dollar and begin trading at $77 and 99 cents. We remind you that trading carries a significant risk of financial loss. It is advisable to consult with a financial advisor prior to making any decisions about buying or selling securities. Your investment choices should not be solely based on the information from stockinvest.us. By utilizing this information, you acknowledge and accept responsibility for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Share your thoughts in the comments below. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and hope you have a beautiful day with warm regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.